Are you suffering with chronic headaches, chronic sinus problems, chronic cognitive issues? I'm going to show you a 3D CBCT scan that we use in our office from a patient that just recently came in with all these kinds of conditions. And we're going to show you how and where structural issues in the neck affect the nervous system and what you You're can do. You're looking at here is a 3D image. It's called a CBCT. Uh, and what it allows us to do in the office is look at the each individual joint. Now, where my cursor is, this is the second cervical vertebra. This is the first cervical vertebra. You can see very clearly on this joint right here, this is where my cursor is. That's the undersurface of the C2 joint, and this is the undersurface of the third cervical joint. And you can see the back edge of C2 joint is backwards compared to the back edge of the third cervical joint. And you can see the front edge of the axis or C2 is backwards of the front edge of the third cervical joint. So some sort of injury happened that caused that joint to shift backwards. And when you have an injury to the joint, it tears the soft tissue, the vertebra gets locked. And we found a very high correlation between C2 problems and cognitive problems, chronic headaches, sinus issues, and actually vertigo is somewhat common also. So that's the left joint. When we turn around, and we look at this other side, we can see the left side of the C2 joint. And you can see you do not have the backward displacement on the back of the joint here. However, you do have a little bit of forward displacement of axis joint on the third cervical. And then when you look at a little bit lower, you can see the third cervical joint is massively cliffhanging off the fourth cervical and the front of the third cervical joint is also backwards of the third cervical joint. So this imaging allows us to precisely uh, find uh, joint misalignments at what level, what side, what's the angle of the joint, everyone's built differently. And then once we have all this information, we make a very precise correction into the joint to set it back in motion. Once it's back in motion, the neurology starts to function better and patients' lives improve. So this patient is already doing much better with these symptoms and we look forward to not only helping her, but many others. And we make these videos because we know that there's lots of people out there on TikTok that are suffering with these problems. They've run through the gamut of mainstream medical care and nobody's been able to help them. So if you're suffering from these types of problems, there's a very good likelihood that your upper cervical spine is involved. You can message us or email us and we'd be happy uh, to help or find someone in your area.